I'm Schmitty, and I completely forgot what I'm doing here. Oh, Quiplash, right, Quiplash. Thanks for joining the party. I may have to send one of you out for ice later. This is round one. I'm going to beam two prompts to your device. Answer them however you choose. What you type goes up against what someone else types, and everyone votes on the winner. You get points based on the percentage of people who like your answer, and a bonus if you get more votes than your opponent. Go! Hit the safety quit button if you can't think of something. Great, let's see what we got here. Number one on the list, a poor follow-up to the X-rated classic Debbie Does Dallas would be Debbie Blank. Okay, pick your favorite and vote. is what people in the early 1900s probably said when they got electricity for the first time. Okay, vote. Next, a new name for... 
four bananas. It's voting time. Next one, the only things that can survive nuclear war are cockroaches and blank. And vote. Coming up next, a bad way to make friends with your new next door neighbor. Vote now. That's round one. Let's see how the scores shook out. Now for round two. Double the points and bonuses, double the excitement. Running out, think fast or use a safety quip. <laughs> All right, let's get to it. First one something you should never do without gloves on. Okay, pick your favorite. Up next, the wrong thing to say after farting in church. Vote on your devices. Moving on, the number one reason people flunk out of ninja school. Ready, set, vote!
next on deck, what you might hear Big Bird say on his deathbed. Time to vote. law that really needs to happen. Put in your votes. <laughs> Round two is over. Let's see who came out on top. This is round three, the last lash. One final chance to catch up and everyone gets the same prompt this time. Complete the comic. Okay, here we go. You get three medals to award to your top three quips. Give out your gold, silver, and bronze medals now. Okay, everyone, let's see who got those medals. Bronze. Show me the silver. And finally, gold. Let's sell off those medals for points. Okay, let's see those final scores.
Hey, welcome to Trivia Night! A gauntlet of pain and judgment. But we're also gonna learn. With a few laughs along the way. I'm going to ask you a bunch of trivia questions. If you get a question wrong, you have to fight for your life in one of my super fun mini games. If you do badly in the mini game, I'll kill you. But don't worry, those can still win the game. I wasn't done talking, but whatever, let's get to it. Okay, first question. I don't know why pop culture likes to make fun of office workers. I was one for decades, and I turned out just fine. What restaurant was Jennifer Aniston hassled about not wearing enough flair in the movie Office Space? Use your device to answer the question. answer is... Who got the question right? <laughs> Everyone is wrong. Come with me. Welcome to the killing floor. I'm going to ask you a question. Your life depends on how you answer. What's the silliest word you can think of? Type an answer on your device and press send when you're finished. Now everyone gets to vote. I want you to pick the answer that you hate the most. The person who wrote the answer with the most votes will die. Pick the answer that makes you go, uh, no sir, no. I will have none of that. The votes are in. I'd ask if you had any last words, but I bet they'd also be terrible. Uh-oh, looks like somebody's a ghosty ghost. But don't worry, ghosts love trivia party games, so you're still in this. You haven't lost or anything. Death is not the end. Let's take a look at the scoreboard, shall we? Do you like it? I took an online C++ course. Aced it. How about this? I'll never forgive it for how it treated Rick Moranis, but... What's the name of the man-eating plant in Little Shop of Horrors? And the correct answer is... This one? of you, prepare for your punishment. Hey girl! Welcome back to the killing floor. Let's draw some pictures! And yes, you should probably feel some pressure right now. Dingleberries. Draw this thing the best you can and press send when you're finished. Everyone gets to vote. Pick the drawing that you hate the most. Pick the drawing that makes you go, uh, no thank you. Yeah. The votes are in. Time to punish the artist. <laughs> nice one, Picasso. Do you remember it when your drawing stunk? Let's see how the scores look now. Alright, next question. 
How long was Juliet's coma supposed to last in Romeo and Juliet? questions for you. Did you know there's a Taj Mahal that Donald Trump didn't build? Which city in India is home to the Taj Mahal? <laughs> Who said this one? One of you is still alive. Let's play a game. Let's test your memory. Everyone gets to play this time. Memorize the pattern. Okay, you've had enough time. Sorry to do this in the middle of a mini game, but I need to do my relaxation exercises. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Ah, yes, that's good. That helps center me. From left to right, what was the order of the colors? If anyone does better than you, I will kill you. And looky looky, here's the pattern. How close did you get? Got it exactly right. Ugh, let's see how your friends did. We'll get you next time. Alright, next question. This in no way gives away our current location, but... ORD is an airport code for which city? I want to show you something. Uh-oh, this is a mess. There's blood all over this art. Eat your heart out, Jackson Pollock. Memorize the pattern of blood. Okay, you've had long enough. Ugh, my tummy's upset. I've been eating a lot of pharaoh lately. A lot of people are hung up on quinoa, but pharaoh is where it's at. Yeah, they're both ancient grains and both are a good source of protein, but only pharaoh gives me that smug self-satisfaction that lets me look down at all you quinoa eaters. Anywho, reproduce the pattern on your device by tapping on all the spaces that were red, then press submit when you're done. The person who is furthest from the pattern will die. Stop admiring your work and turn it in already. Here's that arc again. Now it's time to show your work. You deserve this. The whittling down to just one player has finally come to fruition. Let's do this. Congrats on making it here alive. Now let's see if you can escape with your body. I'm going to give you a category. 
The Babysitter's Club novels. Tap on each answer that fits, then press submit. Let's see the right answers! You move forward one space for every correct answer. You're getting real close to the exit. Oh, did I mention that all the other ghosts get to play too? If a ghost catches up to you, then they will steal your body. Then they can escape and win the game. Here's everyone's next question. And ghosts get a third choice to help them catch up to you. of the Declaration of Independence. Decisions, decisions. Almost up. Kill your friend and come back to life. It's the only way. States of Mexico. Welcome to the sequel. I like to think of this as more of a spiritual successor, so please critique accordingly. Okay now, first question. Which food is fermented to make the Japanese dish miso? Heart. 
Starting now. And the correct answer is... Who got it right? Which leaves only you. Prepare for your punishment. Welcome to the killing floor. Let's play a dice game. I'll go first. Eight. Now I need a little help from a safe player. How about you? In order to live, should they roll higher or lower? You can make it as hard or as easy as you want. The stakes couldn't be any lower. Making it hard on them. I like it. Roll lower than me or you die. What's the singular of dice? Oh, right. Die. Here's everybody's scores. It's a good way to compare yourself to others and maybe start to feel bad about yourself. Let's try another one. Which hockey team is not one of the NHL's original six? answer is this one of you is still alive let's play a game hey girl welcome back to the killing floor every loser must spin the loser wheel come on all the cool kids love spinning wheels <gasps> spin 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 That was as inevitable as Tay Diggs following you on Twitter. <laughs> ah, the scoreboard returns. This thing practically pays for itself. Here's another one. InGen was the evil company in what film franchise? Who picked this one? Let's go someplace fun. It's time for some number fun. Answer as many math questions as you can before time runs out. The person who does the worst dies.
let's get this math party started. Keep shining, you beautiful diamonds. Keep your focus, we're almost out of time. Time to subtract your life. I know, math is evil, even for me. I feel like I should make t-shirts or something. Would people buy those? Or hats, maybe. I'll think about it. Next question. Jamie Lee Curtis was a spokesperson for which brand of yogurt? this again. Idi Amin was the ruthless dictator of what nation? the finger cutting game. I used to call this one Night V Pointy, but the name didn't test well with the focus group I kidnapped. Just choose one of your fingers to cut off. Could it be any easier? Think happy thoughts. Ah! Hope you weren't a pianist. P -a -nist. Let's try another one. Which Real Housewives series is the original? And the correct answer is... This. You're in for a treat. Let's see who's a wordsmith. Use letters to spell the longest word you can before time runs out. My ransom letters could use a little bit more pizzazz. Oh, and all these other players get to play along too. And if any of them spell a longer word than you, you will be punished. Spell words now. The letters don't have to touch each other. And remember to press submit when you're done. I'm so excited to see what you come up with. Ooh, let's see what you did there. Let's see if anyone beat you. Second place is really good. I mean, you're still gonna die, but good for you. They ganged up and killed you. You probably thought they liked you, but then they straight up killed you. That's gotta mess with your mind. Only one player left alive, just how I like it. Well, look who's still alive. Now you just have to escape with your body. Here's your first category. Laxative brands. Tap on each answer that fits, then press submit. What 
I've seen the right answers. A space for every right answer. U.S. Vice President. Anytime today, kiddo. Stick cuts. Stay out of the shadows. Robert De Niro films. You got a ghost breathing down your neck. Spooky! Marsupials. Oh, this is so close. A real photo finish. <laughs> <laughs> 